Hello everyone. So as I mentioned last time on my in my last video, I recorded a adulting 101 video where I was just giving my tips and tricks of um, adulting basically so the video that I recorded was a way too long because I talked too much so I split the video in two I dropped the first part when was it two it was Sunday it was Sunday so I dropped it Sunday and today Wednesday I am dropping a part two so enjoy this is part two and let me know what you think of in the comment my name is Anna Mutombo if you don't know me sorry and leave me a comment subscribe if you haven't yet like the video if you enjoy and enjoy another thing about adulting that's way less dramatic than my <laughs> my previous story is just uh, you have to take your own appointment to the doctors to the dentist and i hate that especially the doctor so the doctor man am i the only one who doesn't really like to go to the doctors because she is noisy i see her like once a year and when i get into her office she's like asking me all my personal business like yeah how much you weigh have you done this and that do you do drugs i'm like kisses <laughs> hold on can we like small talk before can, can you can you ask me <laughs> how's my day how's my year what happened and whatever can we talk about your life too how come you all up in my business for <laughs> i don't know i just I know she's a doctor and whatever, so, but I, I really, really don't feel comfortable going to the doctor and her asking me all types of questions. I'm like, can you, can you be smooth with it? I don't know, y'all need to fix this. And another point about adulting you, <laughs> well, there's some point that you get too old to be on your parents' healthcare. Point in life, you get too old to be on your parents' healthcare, so you have to pay for your own. Uh, 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 why me? So yeah, so you have to get your own healthcare, and uh, and they're not, they're not as good as I mentioned as my parents was. So that's why I don't go as often at the dentist because it costs too much. It used to be free just going to get a cleanup with my parents' healthcare, but mine. I have to pay for everything literally they refund me like some of it but it's not free anymore and I'm like I'm used I'm used to it to be free so that's that's just get on my nerves but you have to do that you know and then another thing after you're done with school you have to get a job a real job Ugh. and for most people and I know for myself <laughs> The, that first job, like you get out of school and you're like, yes, I'm ready to get in real life and whatever, have a, a real job in the field that I studied in because it was nice, it was fun, I learned so much. And then you get in the real life, in the real job and you're like, <laughs> what's this? Like it sucks. And I'm not, I'm not talking for everyone, but I know a few people that after they graduated, they got their first job and they were just like, <laughs> and... That ain't it, and uh, that sucks, honestly. Yo, we put in so much work, so much effort, so much money for it to just be, eh? <laughs> no, and that sucks. Keep on searching, don't stop at your first job. Most probably, I'm telling you, if you're still in school, your first job's gonna suck, and it is what it is, but don't just settle down for that. Keep on looking, and when you're looking for a job, don't just send your resume to one place every once in a while yo be dedicated to it send send your resume to like 10 places every day until you get responses so when you go to your interview just you know be chill be who you are and just just show you show your personality that's what i learned i used to be like okay i, I have to fake this person <laughs> sister let me tell you you're gonna get real exhausted when you start that job and you have to act a certain way and so they they be like okay yes you're good enough for us <laughs> we don't have time so just be yourself if they if they don't like you for you mm, and if they do well great and then if you don't like the job don't be afraid to quit because if something happens to you they gonna replace you in a snap of fingers so yeah keep that 
in your mind. Oh yeah, another thing about adulting is that you, know, <laughs> at some point, you're gonna want to move out of your parents' house because it doesn't work anymore, and you have to just go on about life and explore it and just live everything for yourself. And once you <laughs> start to look at places, the price, um, maybe you want to rent, maybe you want to buy. Personally, I want to buy, and jeez. There's a lot of money. Like you just look at the places you're like, okay, yeah, it's fine, I can do this. And until you take a oh snap, <laughs> I have to furnish this place. Okay, you're like, alright. You look at the things, you know, everything costs like money. Everything costs money. What is that? Who decided that? Everything costs money. You wanna you wanna buy a house, you have to pay, and then you have to pay these this tax and that tax, and then you have to furnish the place. You have to pay for this one. For you have to pay for that. You wanna keep your your um your grass clean. You have to pay for that. You you, you have to pay for literally anything and everything. And ooh, girl, don't go all out when you get your first place. When you're gonna be about to furnish your place, don't go all out with the fancy stuff and whatever your dream Pinterest apartment condo house whatever. Yo, start slowly, just give the essential, and then, <laughs> and then as you go, level up and switch it up, okay? So don't ruin yourself as you move out. Be patient with it, because it takes, it's a big deal moving out, so take your time with it, and I'm really talking to myself right now. <laughs> of course, you're in front of a camera. <laughs> <laughs> to go with this point, if you're paying rent or whatever, mortgage, you'll don't overpay. Don't don't go all out, because sister, <laughs> you don't want you don't want to spend half your paycheck on rent or mortgage every month. You need to have loose to still live. You don't want to just work to pay for your your roof. That's not sustainable. You'll get tired of it. And I don't want you to get tired of it and go back to your parents' basement. We trying to move out one time and do it well. So do it good. Bless you. Thank you. <laughs> and don't try to impress anyone too. I know there's some people that are like, oh no, I can't get this because people will not think this or that. No, 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 no. Sis, don't go broke trying to prove people that you're not broke. It sounds pretty funny. <laughs> Another thing is, it still goes with money actually because adulting is a lot about money and mm, cell phone bills, <laughs> cut that off. Man, cell phone bills cost too much. It's not, not just because Apple decided to release the brand new iPhone 11 Pro Max Titanium Light. promotion, light, whatever wet that you have to go and run and purchase it, sister. It costs too much. <laughs> it costs too much. Let it. You don't need it. If your phone still works, you can still call people. And besides that, I don't know about you, but I barely call anybody. Don't call me. It's so rude. In 2020, who calls people? So whatever. I, ju I, I just text. And even though I barely text because everybody has an iPhone, so I, I message, so I, I don't even need my um like my plan, and I'm always just scrolling on Instagram on whatever. So don't overpay for your phone. It's yo, it's the worst thing. So as adults, we need to be responsible about that and cut the bill of the cell phone off a little bit because. It's too much, okay? That was just a few things I was just thinking. I was like, man, huh, it's so hard. It's not that hard. Let's just try to enjoy the journey because we have to go through it anyways. <laughs> like, you can't go back. So might as well just have fun while doing this. So leave me some of your adulting struggles that you have um, encountered, of um, lived, or experience whatever um recently you're in your life or whatever in the comment section i would love to hear and that will be it for today guys have a great day drink your water um take care of yourself take care of your mental health just like you take care of your physical health because it matters also and just leave me a comment like the video if you enjoyed 
subscribe to the channel if you haven't yet and I will see you in my next one have a great day bye